Definitely they treated my cancer emotionally. Um, it took a very emotional toll. Again, with me being so young, I didn't know how to deal with a lot of things as far as how I was going to look, how I was going to feel, how I was going to be able to deal with taking care of a six-year-old and deal with cancer. Having the Empress of Lloyd Resource Center available to me has been a blessing, in just shorter words. Um, I've been able to come down here and get information um, as far as treatment, um, just little ways to make myself feel better. Um, the Look Good, Feel Better program, uh, getting scarves and head wraps. I had an informational paper that showed me how to tie scarves differently, um, since the wigs really didn't work out for me personally. <laughs> <laughs> and people there just to talk to, even if it's just, you know, just for support, as they've been there. I was sick actually after my last chemo treatment, and um, one of the nurses or one of the resource center people came out and she sat with me the whole time until the cab came and everything, so that was nice. Mm -hmm. That's right. So it's almost like you have a second family. Yeah, of it support. is, definitely. Very nice. When I first got diagnosed, I was a wreck, so I didn't really know how to explain it to her. I didn't know what was going to happen with me myself, and so um, one of the nurses brought me down, and they had a book that actually I just read the book to her, and it just was made it so much easier for her to understand. She had questions. I was able to answer the questions that she had. Um, it was just made it so much easier. <laughs> I would just say thank you and I would just let them know how much of a blessing that they've been just to be able to depend on. They're always here. I've got the number. They always answer the phone whenever I call. So it's just been nice to have them here and to have that resource to go to because I know at other places there's not always someone there that you can turn to like that.